Hi friends, very good morning. Welcome to Anu Academy. Today's class, uh, we will discuss uh, one problem related to financial accounting, related to the uh, accounting equation. Okay, so uh, last class we understood the concept of accounting, accounting equation, right? So based on these things, uh, we will uh, start today's class. Here, a uh, problem is there. We'll start uh, first. We'll read the question and later we'll discuss the solution. Okay. See, show journal entries for the following transactions. Ramesh started business with a cash two lakhs fifty thousand. The second deposited cash into the bank one lakh twenty thousand. Purchased furniture for thirty five thousand in cash. Purchased goods from Deepak of fifteen thousand in cash. Purchased goods from Deepak of 12,000 in cash, paid salary for the month 7,500, sold goods to Mohan of 37,000 in cash, sold goods to Mohit of 18,000 cash, received commission 3,000 by check, paid to Deepak 12,000 by check, received check, received check from Mohit of 15,000, paid rent for the month by check 8,000. Okay, so this is the question. Okay, so of course the size of the question will be a uh, little bit big so don't get confused seeing the size of the question but once you understand the terminology how to start the solution of this problem the problem is very easy and this problem you'll get for full 15 marks definitely if you solve this problem definitely you are going to get uh, full 15 marks either than writing theory answers okay so this is the best way you can get good marks in your subject. Now we will see the solution. See, first of all, you should understand the problem. Until and unless you don't understand the question perfectly, you cannot go for the solution. Okay. So it's always better read the question two, three times. So if you read the question two, three times, definitely you will start solving. Uh, you'll get some idea so that you can give a good solution. You can give a good presentation for your question okay now we'll see the answer see first uh, as this the question is related to show general entries for the following class action so general entries means what are the entries we have to show for the given problem first comes the journal second comes the ledger and third comes the trial okay so like that uh, based on the question based on the marks uh, based on the size of the marks we have to go for the solution sometimes you may be asked only for the general journal only sometimes you you will be asked only for the ledger entry sometimes you will be asked only for the trial and sometimes you'll be asked only for the balance sheet okay then based on the question you have to go for the solution now we'll see the solution here the first step of the solution is first we are preparing the journal we know by the definition what is the journal journal is a book in which all entries are ent entered in a single platform okay so this is the journal so first table of the journal we have to write particulars amount debit and credit okay this is the rules and regulations for writing the journal so particulars amount under amount debit and credit so based on the data given in the question now we are preparing the journal so first is the cash account okay cash account this here you are you have to write uh, debited debitors we call it the short form of debitors cash account to capital account started business with cash how much he has started two lakhs fifteen thousand that is the debit and credit also to the two lakhs fifty thousand all right next uh, bank account to cash account deposited cash into bank same all uh, short uh, debitors you have to write here one lakh twenty thousand and here also one lakh twenty thousand Furniture account to cash account, purchased furniture, this is the debtor, that is 35,000, here also you have to write 35,000, okay. Continuing the table, continuing the journal, next comes the purchase account to cash account, purchased goods in cash from Deepak, this is the debtors, this is the 15,000 and 15,000. Next purchase account to Deepak's account, purchase goods from Deepak on credit, so 12,000 and 12,000 next salary account see all this information is given in the problem based on the information based on the availability of the data in the problem 
we are preparing the ledger we are preparing the journal okay so salary account uh, to cash account paid salary in cash 7500 and 7500 so cash account to sales uh, account sold goods in cash 37000 and this is also 37000 mohit's account to sales account sold goods to mohit on credit 18000 and 18000 bank account to commission received account received commission by check that is 3000 and 3000 Deepak's account to bank account paid to Deepak by check 12,000 and 12,000. Bank account to Mohit's account received check from Mohit 15,000 and 15,000. Rent account to paid uh, uh, to bank account paid rent by check. This is 8,000 and 8,000. So if we add all this uh, um, as we have discussed here, if we add all this debit amount and credit amount, it should be equal. Okay. So here if we add all this debit amount, and credit amount the total should be equal so debit amount total is equal to credit amount so what is the total here if we add it is 5 lakhs 32,500 and same way here also it is 5 lakhs 32,500 right so this is the um, uh, what we have told this is the journal we have prepared the general entries for the given question okay we have prepared the general entry for the given question next what we will solve we will solve the we will prepare the ledger okay so before starting uh, preparation of the ledger we will see the what are the types of accounts okay so preparing the ledger we have to first of all we have to identify the accounts because ledger individually once we are identifying the type of account for the particular type of account we are preparing the entries that is the speciality of the ledger okay so we have to first thing is we have to identify the type of the account so, okay so which type of account it is here uh, the heading is reading types of account account type description okay this is the debit minus credit so personal account accounts of individuals and other business entities debit the receiver and credit the giver real accounts accounts of all the assets debit what comes in and credit what goes out nominal account accounts of expenses losses revenue and profit debit all the expenses and losses and credit all the revenue and profit so if you are getting a question state and explain different types of accounts this uh, information is sufficient to get good marks so always uh, to, uh, with the help of a table try to explain your answer so that you will get good marks next we will discuss the rules for maintaining ledger accounts so what are the rules uh, which we have to follow in maintaining the ledger account so assets expenses and losses when increase we have to debit it when decrease it is credited so liabilities revenue revenue in the sense income and profits when increase credit it when decrease debit it okay now we are going to start preparing the ledger entry okay so as i told you in uh, starting the ledger we have to identify the type of the account so if we don't identify which type of account we cannot prepare the ledger so here so each and everything uh, individual table we have to draw for the ledger so here comes the, the left side comes the debitor and this is the creditor this the name of the account is cash account okay so the table contains the date particulars amount again date particulars amount so up to here this is the debit part and up to here this is the credit part see under this particulars to capital account 250000 to sales account 37000 so we have to add it 287000 same amount it should be equal to the credit also so particulars by by bank account it is 120000 by furniture it is 35000 by purchase 15000 by salary 7500 by balance uh, uh, carried forward so it is um, uh one lakh nine thousand five hundred okay see in this uh, ledger you have to write by 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 and here two 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 you should use these words only okay so these are the uh, words which we are you going to use in uh, journal as well as ledger okay right? now we will continue our ledger next is uh, after completing the next type of account is same table same format the uh, type of the account here is bank account so this is the debitor and this is the creditor date particular amount date particular amount 
तो कैश अकाउंट इट इज वन लैख ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड तो कमीशन अकाउंट थ्री हंड्रेड थाउजेंड तो मॉर्गेज अकाउंट इट इज फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड वन वी एड इट इट इज वन लैख थर्टी एट थाउजेंड सो वाट अब द क्रेडिट बै दीपक अकाउंट ट्वेल्व थाउसेंड बै रेट एट थाउसेंड बै बैलेंस कैरी फॉर्वर्ड इट इज वन लैक एटीन थाउजेंड सो वी इफ यू एड दिस वन इट शुड बी इक्वल टू दिस वन ओके राइट नेक्स्ट नेक्स्ट टाइप ऑफ अकाउंट इज कैपिटल अकाउंट सो सेम डेबिटर्स एंड क्रेडिटर्स सो सेम हेडिंग सो टू बैलेंस कैरी फॉरवर्ड टू बैलेंस इट इज टू लैक्स फिफ्टी थाउजेंड एंड सेम बाई कैश ऑल्सो इट इज टू लैक्स फिफ्टी थाउजेंड नेक्स्ट टाइप ऑफ लेडर अकाउंट इज फर्टिचर अकाउंट सेम टू कैश अकाउंट इट इज थर्टी फाइव थाउजेंड टू बाई बैलेंस इट इज थर्टी फाइव थाउजेंड ओके नेक्स्ट लेडर टाइप ऑफ अकाउंट इज सैलरी सो सैलरी अकाउंट टू कैश इट इज सेवन थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड बाई बैलेंस कैरी फॉरवर्ड इट इज सेवन थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड ओके सो लाइक दैट वी हैव टू प्रोसीड दिस लेडर नेक्स्ट इेक्स्ट इट इज पर्चेस सो पर्चेस ऑलसो सेम नेक्स्ट टाइप ऑफ अकाउंट इज पर्चे अकाउंट टू कैश अकाउंट इट इज फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड टू दीपक अकाउंट इट इज ट्वेल्व थाउजेंड बै बैलेंस इट इज ट्वेंटी सेवन थाउजेंड सो इफ यू एड बोथ द टर्म बोथ द अमाउंट इट इज ट्वेंटी सेवन थाउजेंड इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी सेवन थाउजेंड नेक्स्ट टाइप ऑफ लेजर अकाउंट इज दीपक अकाउंट टू बैंक अकाउंट इट इज ट्वेल्व थाउजेंड टू पर्चे अकाउंट इट इज ट्वेल्व थाउजेंड सो दिस इज इक्वल टू दिस नेक्स्ट सेल्स अकाउंट to balance uh, it is 55000 by bank uh, account 37000 by mohit's account 18000 so 55 is equal to 55 next type of account is mohit's account to sales account it is 18000 by bank account it is 15000 by bank uh, by balance it is 3000 so if we add both the amount it is 18000 so 18000 is equal to 18000 last uh, commission account okay Commission received account to balance it is three thousand by bank account is three thousand so three thousand is equal to three thousand next rent account to bank account it is eight thousand by balance it is eight so eight thousand okay so like that uh, we have to prepare uh, journal entries and ledger entries okay so separate table you have to draw. with uh, giving a heading journal and separate table you have to draw with giving a heading ledger okay so always uh, draw this uh, tables uh, um, do your work um, in a good manner okay use pencil for writing all this uh, tables so that uh, it gives a good presentation and you will get good marks okay so that's all friends for today's class i think uh, this uh, class will be very helpful for your examination right so if you are having any doubts regarding uh, refer that is regarding business economics and financial analysis please post in the comments box i will give you a reply if you have not subscribed our channel please subscribe our channel please like and share our channel thank you very much thank you for watching